Hey guys, this is Nick from Retro Games HQ, and today I am playing another, well, doing another, making another episode of Koromon. So, let's go ahead and make sure. Alright, so Taruga. Poisoned. Not good. I'm trying to remember. Oh, yeah. I said that I was going to catch a new Koromon, and that's exactly what I'm going to do. But first things first, I'm going to heal up because it's going to be stupid to catch one if it means giving up another. So let's see. That is... Oh yeah, I can sell those. I don't need them. <sighs> hmm. Do I need this? No. But I am going to switch it out. Or the Taruga. For say, patter bit. Yeah. Now, if you're already this far into my Koromon, you know, gameplay, go ahead, subscribe. I know if you're this far, you've heard it multiple times. Well, this time, if you haven't already, go ahead and do subscribe. And you've also heard my whole thing about, hey, do you want to get a unit market for a game? Well, then go to humblebundle.com. <laughs> or rather, go to my link below, uh, in the description below, rather. Which is nixonr.com forward slash humble bundle. They help with charity. You get a game and part of the proceeds go to uh, me. With no extra cost to you. And what you're doing is supporting this channel. Supporting more gameplay like this. I did not mean to do the stinky whatever thing. Oh, back. Hold shift. Alright guys, let's get into this. Okay. This is the second time I think I've had the chance to get Mofil. Not really something I want, per se. But you know what? If I can get him, I'll take him. Now. I got a Trick Spear. Most efficient when used at the start of a battle. So, let's go ahead and use this Trick Spinner to see if I can catch him. One. Two. Three. Four. Caught. Awesome. Trick Spinner did real well. Um, no, I do not want to give him a nickname. That's kind of weird. Yes, I would. Let's check out Muffle. Mofel. Whatever. Muffle. Okay, so HP is 34. Text 23. Special attack 23. Speed's 14. Defense is 15. Special defense is 11. Oh, man. Unless this dude evolves soon, I don't see him staying with us too much longer just for being KO'd. <laughs> So he's standard, but he's sand. Uh, common rarity, sadly. Now, it's again, you know about my Steam streaming thing. What low arbor? So, scratch. Let's see what these do. Okay, scratch. Cut, 40. 20% increased critical chance, uh, critical hit chance. Coin snatch. Um, sand, 40. It's a special, which is a special is lower than his uh, physical. 10% chance of lowering its accuracy, so that's not bad, you know? And then tail spin. 25, because remember, really, tail spin should do damage as it did in the Pokemon anime, if you remember. Slap the foe around with a swing, at least in the dubbed version. Sli slap the foe around with a swinging tail for one to three times. 25, that's not bad. Um... Not super impressive, not horrible. So lucky. The po the Koromon is so lucky that it has 25% persist percent increased critical hit chance. Oh my gosh. So hold on. Scratch is going to be a great move. Man. That's pretty good. Alright, he's joined our party. Well, they call him squad, is a squad but it's a party. Frova? No. Man, Frova needs to evolve. This dude got a thing on. I'm gonna assume he does. Oh, I can go down? Onto a beach. Oh, I thought this was a desert. Oi there. I'm Captain Derek, the ferryman of Donar Island. I was told by Regal to take a trainer to the island. That must be you. 
Do you see the beauty over there? Just look at her. Glistening in the sun. She'll take us across the waves. We'll be at the Don Donor Island before you know it. I don't know what accent I'm doing right here. Not yet, bud. Oh. Yesterday, I almost caught a nipple gar, but it bit my fishing rod in half. Well, I guess it ain't much. Ha ha ha, stupid joke I was about to make. Ain't much of a nibbler, ha ha ha. I hate pussy jokes. We're here to take you to Donor Island. The captain and his boat are at the beach. Cool. Hey, you there. You're Retro Games, right? Yes, the captain thought you might go this way instead. Rigo requested us to take you to Donor Island. The captain's boat right at the beach. Ooh, I hate them. They purposefully put that right there so that I could not get it. What the heck? Oh. Ah. Hmm. <laughs> that is why you explore, guys. Because you might find something like that. No, I'm gonna keep doing this. Bye. Because I kind of want to make sure I'm getting everything I can. Dude's blocking me from going this way, though. So I'm just gonna do this. Oh, there's another thing. Silver spinner. Awesome. Of course, I don't need too many spinners, I guess. I mean, it won't hurt to have Phoenix Shard, something I can sell. It won't ha hurt to have more. Just because, um... You know, there may be something I really want, and it keeps breaking out. Yeah, anchors away. All right. I hope you don't get seasick. Well, I can say the same. I hope I don't get seasick. However, I do not get seasick. Iro, rather. Here we are, all safe and sound, thanks to my wonderful ship. Although, being on the water is overrated. I, I, I've been on it. I don't understand the whole, oh, let's get on the boat thing. At all. No pill. I was trying to cruise ship. Still. Hmm. What's this? I don't recognize that ship. Well, that's a pirate ship. What? But I do know that flag. That symbol is of Umbra Noctis. So look, Solus. And Umbra. So Lux. Umbra. Solus. Noctis. Uh. So you get where they got that name. Them being here can't be good. You better hurry to Niccolo and Thomas. They operate the Buzzlet Lab. Buzzlet. Oh, that's the Wasper. Um, or Hornet, whatever. No, Buzzlet is the one that looks like an insect. But there's no insect top, but it's like... It zaps you. In the center of the island. So you can probably find them there. Oh, and in case you want a ride back, just let me know. I'll be right here. Oh, he pulled out a freaking umbrella. He's a seaman, but he wants to take out an umbrella. Okay. Oh, yo. I'm just gonna talk to you, bud. Man, what a pitiful place this crap shoot is. I just wanted to explore a little. And for an island, this is. Mm -mm. Okay, sorry. Sneeze. So, Nicola is the head of the Buzzlet Lab. He's probably there, but you'd have to check to be sure. Cool, I wanna go in here. I wanna go everywhere but where I'm supposed to go. Let's see what's here. Maria, if Gormon run out of SP, a SP cake small will make them radiate with energy again. I'm gonna call it radiate, sure. Those umber noctis grunts emit evil energy. I have a bad feeling about them. They're up to no good. I'm stocking up on the cakes, just be safe. You can never have too many cakes. Bop, bop, bop. Lovely weather, isn't it? How can I assist you? Sell item. Sell. Sell. And that's how you make a lot of money. Right there. So, normal type, okay. Stinky disc. Bird fruit. Sinky scent. Eh. I got what I needed when it comes to selling stuff. 
by atoms. That's a lot, man. If that's what you're thinking, you are correct. One, two, three, four, five. No. Spinner. Ooh. Yes, please. I would like to have that. No. So I still have a crap ton. Would you like to use one of your coupons? I did just spend a crap ton. So yes. Absolutely. I should have bought more, guys. I just forgot about that. Yeah, I should have bought a crap ton. Uh, yeah, I should have bought pretty much the whole in what I could out of my money and then get that back. And that's going to be a huge discount. Because I still have 4,866. I got all those things. Yep. So that's probably the lab. I heard Umber Noctis approaching, but I was too late to warn everyone. I hope none of my colleagues were trapped in a Thunder's Cave. Let's go in here and see what the heck is in here. Speak. Hacking? No, I'm doing penetration tests on Patterbit for Lux Solus. Oh, I see you have a patter bit. You know, I think I managed to circumvent the security of the official Pitterbot kernel. This would allow me to install a Pitterbot kernel on your patter bit. Would you like your patter bit to try it out? Well, guys, if he dies, he dies. I'm all about trying. You know, I'm on um, insane. So let's just try everything out, you know? I'm putting... <laughs> yeah, come on, Patterbit. So I'm guessing, guys, that there's different evolutions to Patterbit. That's all I can guess. Why would I think that? I mean, I, that's what I'm guessing, because shouldn't there be a legal one also? But there's Pitterbot. So, we now have a better Patterbit. Patterbit was already insane. I didn't expect to evolve him. Oh my god, what's the stats now? Okay. If, um, let me go to your... Yeah, I, I want this. Huh? What the... Sure, I'll... What the heck? Apparently you can plant crap. I didn't know that, but let's go see. Um, Jeff Prova, Pitterbot, not Patterbit, but Pitterbot. Oh no, guys, come on, come on, Pitterbot. Yes, summary. Holy crap! Okay. Okay, so. Let's just think about this. First, I want to see is passive. This Cormon charges when hit by an electric attack, increasing its speed. So we got to remember that. Mm -hmm. Okay. So HP at 55. Attack at 30. Attack's pretty good. Special attack of 44. Speed of 24. Defense of 36. And special defense of 36. So if we go to... Say this. Hey, this guy's speed's better. He's way better when it comes to special defense. Defense, special attack, attack, HP. Um, 27, 26, so SP's still about the same. Let's go to Guildwing. Attack's the best he's in. Um, special attack sucks. Special defense is man. Special, or defense is man. Speed is good. HP is okay. I think it looks like Guild Wings should evolve again. Like that low of a level evolution and just the appearance, it looks like he should evolve again. I don't know, but and it just looks like Malfell should evolve. And I know, I know Frova has to be, be, be 
uh, able to evolve. Of course, so is Taruga, surely. So right now, I think I'm doing better than... It, right there, that instantly made me do better. So I'm glad I went around to these houses before I actually went and followed the, like, you know, actual story. I hope this invasion will pass soon. It worries me, even though it's happening for a brief moment in time. Eureka! This item will surely help. Here, take one. Attack cake. Okay, well, let me get behind you. Oh, no, okay, cool. You could have just left any oven. I would have taken it. Get this stupid cursor out of my way. Oh. Umbra Noctis doesn't scare me. I can see right through him. Can you see the power tower over there? Let's observe it to determine what it is. It was built to act as a lightning rod that can store the energy from the bolts that hit it. That energy is then transported to all of Velua. The titan living there bends the weather, guiding thunderstorms to the island. It's thanks to Volkgar that we'll never run out of energy. Can I walk? No. Coriolisoriboro. I hope she sees it. Hey. Do, 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 do. Do, do keep checking everything. Nope, no thank you. No thank you. Although I do want what I saw over here. What? 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 Mm. What the heck? Escape. Ah. Sweet. So that's how you do that. Which means I could have probably done that earlier, couldn't I? Can I do it here? No. Okay. What's the name of this place? Brightening the world one ray at a time. It's pretty gloomy. Here. I tried to battle Umber Noctis guards in front of the power tower, but they were too strong for me. Uh, oh, personal Coromon. No. Definitely not. Heal me. Welcome to the trainer hub. Would you like us to take care of your Coromon? There we go. Thank you for waiting. We did our best to restore all of your Coromon, but it appears our healing device disabled your... What the heck? Okay. Hey, you broke my pitter butt. Oh, that's not good at all. Let me have a quick look. You know, you're right. My kernel's bugged. I'll have to uninstall the kernel so that I can review the logs and improve my code. This should also remove the bug. Please do. Okay, I am reverse. I am de-evolving to Patterbit. Thank you. There you go. Another ticket closed. Until my own software is stable, I'll return to selling the officially... Until my own software is stable, I'll just return to selling the officially licensed Pitterbot. Hey, do you want me to install officially licensed for a thousand? What is so good about the other Pitterbot? Oh my god. Yes. Okay. 
<sighs> is this gonna be not as good? Was the other one well, like a jacked pattern bot? Yeah, let me see if this was like a. Oh, go back. Let me see if that was a jacked. Really wasn't jacked or anything. Oh, oh. Odd. Odd, 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 odd. Anyways, let's go back to heal. Although I should beat them. Yeah, I should beat these idiots. Messing with my Coromon in a way I didn't ask him to. Nothing wrong with piracy. I mean, support the people you like. The artists, the game developers you like. I just morally, legally, while in a positive legal sense, yes, there is a problem because it's illegal. Though I'm saying that's not a justifiable thing. All IP is unjustifiable. My Hound Dose finally got a trait after using the trait Formator on the upper floor. It was slightly expensive, but very worth it. What? If you're interested, get look uh, against intellectual property by Stefan Kinsella. So Stefan Kinsella, but A, but, you know, P H, P H A, pretty much. Stefan. What? Oh, what are you talking about, buddy? Oh, another admirer, my potent inflator. You're what? Uh, the potent inflator. You look confused. Let me explain why I've designed the potent inflator. When I was still a young tra uh, tamer, yeah, tra I almost got a corn mom with potent. Uh, potent potential. It was almost perfect. So I thought, what if I could increase the Cormon's potential? That's why I, I dedicated my life to the Potenta Flater. And I can say with my pride, it works. The Potenta Flater makes all Cormon perfect? Oh no, I'm afraid that's not possible. It's, it can only slightly increase a Cormon's potential. To be exact, the Potenta Flater will increase a Cormon's potential value by one. But if you're lucky, the Potenta Flater can increase the potential value more than that. Just let me know if you want to give Potenta Flater a spin. Ah, oh, yes, I see you and your squad have loads of potential for growth. Shall we use a potential flater? Potential flate. So, while Guildwing's cool, Mofel's cool, Prova's cool, Guildwing's really cool, I love Taruga, I love Patterbot. I want both to succeed. Yes. Let us see what happens. Watch your phone, I'll send you a message when it's done. I'm sorry? He just re Oh, crap. Okay. Oh, hello there. You must have come to try out my latest invention, the Trait Formator. The Trait Formator? What does that do? Let me ask you this. Have you ever captured a Coromon without a trait? That's some bad luck right there. No worry. That's where my Trait Formator comes in. It takes your Coromon and it gives it a trait. Oh, that's useful for sure. But what if my Coromon already has a trait? Yes, I've thought of that as well. In that case, my tra trait formator will change the trait of the Cormon. So in short, your Cormon will either get a trait it has, uh, if it has none, or it will get a new one. Just let me know when you want to try it out. You could just said, um, no matter what, it gets a new one. <laughs> it's all that complicated crap. Let me see. One. Bam, 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 bam. Clean your tree. Cured of all status problems when it's returned to its spinner. Fruit is healthy. Coromon restores 20 HP. Robber. The spoils go to the victor. Still 50% extra gold. Hey, all mine's got decent. And I ain't giving up anything more than what I've already done. And I just got that for free. So I like that. Um, you better give me my freaking dude back pretty soon. Because I kindly need him. I better not wipe. This be stupid to wipe. I mean, heck, increase my um, potency. I'm cool with that, definitely. Just not at too expensive of a trade off of, you know, wiping, losing. That's not fun. Buzzlet Lab. Do, do, do. Bump, bump. Let's go talk to this dude. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
I'm glad I'm indoors. I don't like the raindrops colliding with me. You could have said you don't like the rain, man. I can always see the positive side of things. Even with Umber's Noctis around. Or Umber and Noctis. Reminds me of Una Anus or whatever. Um, Markiplier and Ethan's thing. Even with Umber and Noctis around, we can still supply Velua Vil uh, with battery packs. For now. Even with Umber and Noctis here, we still abide by the rules. You need a lab coat. For entering. Okay. Glasses. Lab coat. Yep. Because apparently it saves ra me from radiation. Oh, they're here! Okay, Nicola. Oh, is that supposed to be after Nicola Tesla? Like the hairdo and everything? I don't know. Oh, I thought you were one of the Umper Noctis gar grunts. They're everywhere. At the docks? In the Thunder's Cave? Soon they'll be here as well. We're not safe here. Calm down for a moment. Can you tell me what's going on? Yes, you're right. Breathe in. Count to four. My dear partner and colleague, Thomas, I can't reach him anymore. He went into the Thunder's Cave to find a potent buzzlet. A type of Coromon we need to keep up the energy demand of Velua. But now that Umber, Nocti Umber Noctis has shown up, I'm so worried. Don't worry, I can help. If you could get Thomas back here safely, that would mean the world to me. But be careful when you head into the Thunder's Cave. It gets very dark when you go deeper inside. I have a helm with an integrated light, which will help you get around down there. Please take it. Hey, pretty cool. Be quick and good luck. Electricity is just electrons moving from one place to another. If I move, am I electricity as well? Ooh, that's pretty cool. Hold on. We're switching to potent Coromon. They have a higher power efficiency. Or... Should we just switch to perfect Cormon? Either way, we're switching. So, Baz or Buzzly. Baz or Habaz or Buzz. The electricity gathered at the power tower is transported through cables to all of Velua. But did you know there are gases which can conduct electricity as well? Be careful when you use that stink module in a thunderstorm. Oh, okay. Umbizer. That is actually pretty freaking neat. Alright, let me go in lab coat, glasses, and a miner's helmet. This will work perfectly. And can this dude please get me my... Um, you know, Patterbot back. Not Patterbit, but Patterbot. Anyways, that's all for this video. I'll be making another one. Oh, wait for this good. Right now. So, go ahead and subscribe. If you haven't already, you want to get a game, go to nixonr.com forward slash humble bundle. It's in the description below. Help charity, help me, and you get a game. It's all pretty good. Anyways, that's all for this video, and I'll see you in the next one. So, retro on.